so i'm just going to teach you how i do my makeup and this is like how i literally just do my makeup like an easy tutorial so first i'm going to i already drew my brew but don't worry i'm going to drop the brew tutorial for you how i drew my brow. so i'm just going to like use a wipe to clean my face and like clean excess away from my face so i'm just going to clean it and just like clean it you know just prep the face because i told you always wet your face with something before you put up your foundation so that it will it'll be easy to rub in and it will not be cakey so next i'm just going to go on with my foundation i don't even know why i'm so bubbly today but god knows best so i'm just going to like spread my foundation out like polka dots just going to put it everywhere just going to keep putting it applying it and applying it everywhere after i finish applying it i'm just going to make sure that enough consistency is on my face after i finish applying it i'm just going to get my foundation brush and blend it can you see how smoothly and fine it's blending into my skin like no pressure at all i got the power so like no pressure at all just blend it in like that no problem no pressure like that just blend it in just going to make sure i blend it. i mean what about me like my whole makeup what we take my time most is the blending process my blending process takes my time and like this now i'm blending i'm blending i'm like oh my god i'm on a journey to blending station i am blending i am blending i'm blending like no mercy for this foundation no mercy for this brush the brush is like what am i what have i done to you i'm just your service dog i'm like shut up blend this foundation into my skin because i want to look I want this foundation to look as fine as possible so i'm just going to blend and just do it like that just going to blend so i'm not don't blend the foundation to your eyes your eyes and your brow is where your foundation you should never blend your foundation to do not blend in there so just just blend like that blend I and mean, when you are blending you blend to your neck you blend to your neck, you blend to your ear, blend under your eye very well, blend every fucking place on your face very well. You blend to your neck, you blend to your ear to make sure that everything is fine as possible. Just I'm let me just check in if I blended the neck very well. Just blend it, don't be shy. Blend it because you don't want to be look like a two colored masquette here. You want to look like all natural look like your foundation to be the same as your neck. So just blend very well. Take your time. No rush. Okay. No rush. Just take your time and do this thing very well. Just blend. After you finish blending. After you finish blending. So I just blend very well. Very well. Remember, of course, after I finish blending, you get your concealer. You put your concealer under your eyes, under the eyes. That's where you, you should be putting your concealer. So, you are putting your concealer under your eye. Just continue like that. Continue like that and just continue putting it like that. Continue like that. You put it under your eye. You put it on your nose. A fine line on your nose. Then... You put it on your forehead a little bit and the middle of your forehead, you put it in the middle of your forehead and you put it on your chin, 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 on your chin, like that. So I'm just going to like blend it in like this. I'm going to use my foundation brush to blend it in well because man you gotta blend i told you before and i'll say it again makeup is blending if you blend well the outcome of your makeup will be very wow very wow so you're just gonna blend it like that just blend continue blending take your time do not rush during this time of this this during this process do not rush do not rush. Take your time and blend this thing to satisfaction. Okay? Take your time and blend it well. 
and yes one thing as you are blending your foundation the, the concealer under your eye blend it to your eyelid blend it to your eyelid where you'll be applying eyeshadow blend it there so your eyeshadow when you apply your eyeshadow is going to be a thick base right there it's going to stick to the concealer it's just like a base the concealer in your eyelid is the base for the eyeshadow don't forget always take your time when you are doing this thing take your time And please ignore my motions during this video, like the the way I'm behaving in this video, because I don't even know what is wrong with me. Why I'm so bubbly? I'm just jumping. I'm restless. I admit it. So please focus on the makeup and do not focus on my bubbliness. Thank you. So I'm just going to. I'm not going to use my foundation brush to blend that. Um, Think that line on that concealer line on my nose i'm going to use a beauty blender because it's better it's because if i use that foundation brush to blend the concealer it the concealer is going to spread all over all over my nose so what is the need of putting a thin line if we know we're just going to blend it all over the nose which you can just as well pack it all over our nose so we're just going to use a, a, a beauty blender and thinly blend it then i'm just going to you do a powder coat before I, I set my face with a setting powder. I'm just going to do a powder coat. Before I set. Do not powder coat your eyelid. Leave the concealer the way it is for your eyeshadow process. Just powder your face, your forehead and everywhere else except your eyelid. Okay? So now I'm going to get my setting powder and set my face before I do my oh my god my nose was very was very itchy at that stage and I just had to sneeze god god I did the thing got everywhere but it's a mess it's a mess how we clean it's not your it's not your people's fault so I'm just going to use a brush to apply my buttercup matte setting powder on my eye under my eye sorry under my eye everywhere you put concealer on your nose everywhere you put everywhere you put um concealer you have to put your setting powder there so it was the con it can set the concealer before you wipe it off your makeup is going to look as fine as shit. Just continue like that. And please, be generous with the amount of the setting powder you are going to be using. Because you just, it, at the end of the day, it's going to be half on your face. So, be generous with the, with the setting powder. So... Just going to put it everywhere. Be generous with it. And don't forget the, the middle of your forehead. So after setting everywhere, I'm going to work on the eyeshadow while the setting powder sets on my face. It's a very long process, but it's going to work. So you just have to calm down when you do your makeup because at the end of the day, it's your beauty, not anyone else's. So you have to calm down to make sure it looks. Like it was a really long process before I could, before I could choose a um, eyeshadow color because I just come up with eyeshadows to mix together to get one. But inspiration comes first, right? So I was just like bathroom and contemplating on what eyeshadow I should use. I was like, at the end of the day, I was like, I'm a baby girl. So I was like, should I go for that one first? Mm -mm. 
no no so i was like you know what let's go for baby girl look so i'm going to go with that pink like baby girl look so i'm just going to go in and like it was a long process but when we get there i'll tell y'all So I decided that I'm going to go for that baby girl look. So now I, another problem was that I was contemplating on how to show you all the color I wanted to use. But I was like, no, the physics has not entered yet. But I was like, calm down, don't panic. I was like, oh my God, I'm so fed up of this. What the freak? I was like, I'm going to... I was like, wait, hold on. I think I have an idea. I was like, hold on. I was like, come back and I was like... I finally found the physics. Look at it. I finally found the physics. Like, that is the color. I'm going to be using that shiny light pink. I'm like, okay, sassy get on. Material girl. I'm just going to apply it thick. Apply it thick. Because you are still going to blend the eyeshadow. Apply it thick. So because you are still going to blend the eyeshadow. Because if you apply it thin and you blend the eyeshadow, at the end of the day, you can end up getting nothing. You understand? So apply it thick because you're going to blend. So I'm just going to show, like, that is how I'm just applying it. I'm, like, I'm applying, like, the outside of the eyelid first. Then I decided to use a different shade for outside my eyelid. I decided to use a different shade. The camera is not capturing how beautiful the eyeshadow is. But at the end of the video, you all will see how beautiful it is. And y'all can see that um, I'm very angry at my brushes today. I don't know why Aaron called me. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to blow this brush. Because if I decide to break this brush, it's money. I'll just blow it because they will feel the pain of the air in their wings, their whatever, their feathers. Um, I was so tired today. Like, I was having a very banging headache. The headache was banging. It's like, well, I have to do this makeup tutorial. I was like, okay, I'm just going to put it on. So, I don't know what, why I'm bubbly, but no problem. God knows best, like I said before. So I'm just going to use it and just apply, apply, apply. Be generous with it. Be generous with it. So, just like that. So, that's just it. Like that. Okay, I will tell you when I finish the second eye. <laughs> So this is just me like trying to push shimmer on the eye because I wanted like something sparkly to complement the color. So like I was like trying to figure out the kind of shimmer to put because the shimmer was not shimmering at this point. I was like no I think I'm going to mix like three shimmers to get the perfect shimmering on my eyes. So I was like okay let me just say I'm going to add another shimmer. Let me just say. If not everywhere, like maybe under the eye, maybe under the eye at that point. So now I'm just getting a darker, like a very dark brown color to put outside the eye, just to blend it outside the eye, so it to be like smoky waves coming through my eyes. So I'm just going to like do that, like that. Just going to continue do it for the second eyes too. So like that. Just blending everything through. I'm just going. I'm just blending. 
so you can see i'm just blending so i'm just like okay i like the way the blending came out no problem so now time for that sparkle i was telling y'all about time for that sparkle i was putting the sparkle at first i was like can y'all see this sparkle can y'all see this sparkle because i can't see no sparkle this sparkle is not sparkling this sparkle is not sparkling like god this sparkle i, I don't i don't like the way this sparkle came out mm -mm. No, I think I'm going to. I have a better sparkling idea. And I like, let me see if I will apply. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! This sparkle came out okay. It came out okay. I was like, mm, put more, add more, add more. Like that. I use that for the second eye. So I'll tell you when we are ready. <laughs> So like this just make on like I'm more and I did tired like this so but let's just quickly blow like we are going to use our powder brush to just brush the setting powder away. We're just gonna do like that and like that. Just gonna do that like that, like that, and like that. Just gonna everywhere we added setting powder, we're just going to use our brush to to like clean everywhere like dust everything away make sure you dust it very well and please don't drag it on your skin just like small flat thrusts flat thrust, just like quickly quickly like a quickie so like just gonna do that i was like oh my god i'm so hungry at this point but i'm gonna do this for the fans so i was like oh my god what is wrong with me what is wrong with me so i want a tiger key hey. so i was like okay no problem sharp I was like, okay, let's just dust this thing once more and let's do what we're gonna do. So, like this, at this process, I'm going to add my blush. So, y'all should just see, I'm going to add my blush now. <laughs> I was like, let me just like put coat powder on my face on top of the blush again. I was just like, just do that, do that again. I just coated powder on top of my blush like that. Just go in with it. Don't be shy. I've always told you not to be shy. So I'm just gonna go in like that and like that. So next, I'm going to be using my bronzing palette only to, to only to figure out that my sister already broke it, but. No problem, Sha. I cannot go out to buy another one now. I'm halfway through the video. Just like, just put it like that. I'm more happy with this. Like, I was like, oh my god, what the freak? So I was just like, just quickly put this she on my face. Put it like this. Put it like that. Fly it up and put it up on the nose. I was like, this thing is not applying. What is going on here? It's not applying. It's not giving me the shine I want on my on my jaw. Like, that's the jaw, right? On my cheekbones. I was like. What is going on here? But I have a better idea. So I just use another bronzing palette to just put it up now. Now that is some shimmer. Nice bitching. So I was just like, just go in again, just go in with the other side. And the nose is the favorite part of this makeup for me. Like <coughs> my nose during that period is my favorite part. So I was just like, just put the nose and let's see how it will go. I was like, wow, it came out well. So I was like, okay, let's just put it well. Wow, 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 wow. It came out well. Okay, so like, okay, highlights are done. Like, nice. I'm, I like the way it's looking natural. So like, I was like, okay 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 what else am i going to do okay i'm not going in with my off my full-time 
tinted brow gel just on just go on the brow and just to set that baby straight just go on her and set that baby straight i was like okay no problem <laughs> But this thing is not looking natural, but it's better than the bed ass. Like, I cannot see anything through with that bed ass. So I was like, okay. Now, lash glue from Classic. Like, it's so freaking classic. So, I'm just going to go in. And I'm like, I was not pattering. So, I'm just going to play music while I fight how to open this lash. Finally, I got the lash off. Like, oh, God. Women. Like, oh, my God. Women are trying. I'm like, now, time to open this 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 lash glue now like ugh, women struggles so i was just like be generous with the amount you are putting because you're going to blow it dry a little bit dry just be generous and put just put that baby right there so like that like that like that <laughs> Yes, I'm combing my lashes. I'm combing my natural lashes before I applying this synthetic one, this man-made one. So it will stay and like it will not be too bushy and it, I will not blind by mistake or for video. So like I would advise you to comb your lash before you put lash on your lash. So like like this now I'm just going to like oh this is not straight. Let me say this thing well. It's not like pressing, press them where well, press it like press it to your natural lashes. That that line that is that root, that farm that is holding your natural lash, press it there. Like that. So I'm just going to play music while I fix the second one. Okay, I got it, goddess queen. Mwah! Like look at this bitch now. I'm just going to play music why I why I I fixed the second lash because this first lash was first lashing. <laughs> Lashes black, my lashes is pink. No, we don't want that shit. Okay, so we just have to use mascara to blend it all together. Now, time for a second lash. Now, no magic, guys. I tried to do magic like magic. Like, look at now. I already did a second eye. Is, is that magic? No magic. In. It's magic. In. Time for the lips. So, I decided to use my brown eye pencil. To just line my lips, line my lips, then I will be back. Just line the lips, like line your lips with brown eye pencil. It depends on the kind of eye pencil you want, but me, I did. I decided to use brown eye pencil. I don't want blacky on my lips. Okay. <laughs> Pink, so that is how I got this glassy, mad looking lips. Okay, best at doing full makeup, they're finishing up with 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 lip gloss. It's me, oh, yeah, what goes to me. But you can do whatever lipstick you feel goes if you feel red goes on you, red and nude, whatever kind of color of lipstick, just go for it, baby. You're a goddess. So we're just going to go like that. And just like, I was like, mm, I think I'm missing something. So, like, I was like okay i'm just going to go in with what they call 
what they call finish. Oh God, what am I even saying? I said that I, I decided that I wanted to do a Marilyn Marrow dot. So that dot your eyes like that and just go there. I decided to do another one near my smile line. I was like, should I do it? I was like, what do I have to lose? After putting that one, I just started to go in one point that one like that. Can you see how cute it looks? I was like, okay, that was nice. It's looking good. No problem. What's that to lose? I was like, I was not like, oh, there are future husband. There's a few things you need to know. Just going like that. So I was like, looking at myself. I was like, I was even forgetting that I was vlogging. And I was like, ah, oh my God. So now finishing spray. Thank God. I was like, hey, this is not my eye, Jesus. Oh, but it smells nice, actually. Hmm. It smells nice. Hmm. Nice. So I was like, okay, okay. Fan it, 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 like you're fanning something. Just fan it, fan it, fan it, fan it, fan it, fan it, oh. Okay? So the, the team will not look cakey. Okay? So like, now that's this, the finishing look. It looks good. It looks amazing. <laughs> Thank you.